Hello and welcome back to Railway Empire. Well, yeah, we'll hope for no crashes today. And if you're wondering why I sounded a little bit rushed in the last episode, it's because I've got a limited time frame for recording. So anytime a game crashes, uh, I'm, I'm on playing catch up. It's okay, I've had a breather, got it sorted. We have a connection bonus just uh, thrown up there. What is it? An express. Okay, we might we might set up an express and see if we can achieve that. It's not important, but it's fun to do, isn't it? Yeah, because it see we can see where our lines will head. I, I think there's enough maintenance at stations now on our routes. Another good reason to have them for things like that that crop up for little strange uh, express lines direct. So yeah, what are we doing today? This is going to have no freight for a while because we've got to fill up this warehouse. Now we should start thinking about filling up this warehouse as well. Do we actually have, we don't yet, but we can use this, can't we? We can put grain in there. And I believe it's kind of the only grain around for us up this end. Uh, yes. Yes, it is. Well, there you go. So, uh, should we do that straight away? Let's uh, set that one up to go in there. We do kind of want grain in here, I think. I feel like going direct is a better idea. Still, how we'd get there though is all sorts of awkward. So yeah, let's let's stick to uh, sending this one direct to the warehouse, and then we can work on it, can't we? Sure. Less less uh, breakdowns, was it? Uh, less maintenance. Less maintenance. The more it's on the move. So yeah, that's uh, a lot of money for us. It is now that we're delivering a lot. Do we have a... We do have one on there. I was going to say, do we have a maintenance shed on there? Do we have one on here? Yes, we do. I'm just double checking. Vimabee's growing, which makes me all sorts happy. Now, we could use one of those on here, couldn't we? He didn't get one last time. He did before it crashed, but then not on the return journey. As, we, uh, as we're at the mercy of RNG. Uh, you're going to need... Yes, because you're like a little shuttle line. This is all this is going to be used for, is the, the warehouse run. You're going to need a, one of those, and I bet you go and stop at it. Let's see. Is he slowing for it? There he goes. Yep, yep, yep. They only get slowed. It's not too bad, but it's not ideal, is it? All of this, we're going to sort out. I just hope everything we did up here has been uh, remembered. Where, where have we gone? We're up near Orobro. Yeah, this is the this is the iron and coal. That's going to be fine for now. It's going to take a while. Plus, it's the winter. Uh, so, yeah, if it is the winter up here and it slows these trains down, they're then going to have freight again. It looks horrible these X's, and it's not ideal, but it, it's not the end of the world either. I mean, it's more than doable, right? We have a connection here. How is this warehouse doing? We shouldn't really be up here. You're not getting apples, are you? I guess they're taking them. We're going to need another train dealing with these, aren't we? Let's uh, double that up then. It was an issue before, but then we... That's not how you double it up. Yeah, it was an issue before, but that's before we split off up to uh, this end. We had our other train coming across here. I do like this layout a lot better. And do you know what? That's screaming out to be a... Uh, maintenance yard isn't it we'll we'll look into that later on but anyway we're up here for this knee shopping all the way to where Helmstad can we do that where's Helmstad you're all the way up here well you'd gonna you're gonna be going this way aren't you there is no real way to get over there you'd have to go all the way no you can't go down there well there you go that's highlighted an issue for us that we kind of split to go across the where would that be north east yeah we're kind of split to go across to the east which is weird we should have yes right let's do that because i don't like that at all we we need a way to get a, that way don't we to go across there and since that ideally could be a maintenance yard anyway we can add another supply tower where this train is. Delete the section in between and I'd change it to a maintenance yard. Regardless, I like it. 
There we go. The things like these express lines do highlight any issues you've got or things you've not accounted for, I should say. Right, let's sit you just there. We'll delete this back. There we go. We'll delete that back and then we can split. It's four lines, but we can have another split there. And that way they can dance around, can't they? Yeah, perfect. Right, let's stagger these and then reconnect them back up. I'd like them to go in smoothly, even though I don't think it makes the greatest amount of difference. There we go. Now, what we could do is have them filter into a single lane. But I'm going to go with our, our new plan to be able to force a junction such as this to work. And there you go. Every time. Isn't it beautiful? I still like that. I'm going to be using that all the time from now on. Anyhow, right, you don't need a signal there, that will cause issues. You do not need one there, that will cause issues, would it? Yes, it would. And we can redo the ones there and there. There we go, that should be good. You can sit in there. Perfect, right, we need to hook this one back up and we'll do it from that point and we'll stagger them. I mean, this does lend us options to branch out uh, across the uh, the east here uh, into that warehouse as well so i do like this given that should we do something like this for this one we'll go like that no we can make that junction i do like the junctions if you do it like this it's a, and actually yes this would be better for this section of track like that the reason being is they won't trip over each other at a junction like the two lines are separated and then the the maintenance yard uh, handles all the queuing. And then that way, this is going to head off to the warehouse over here. Where is it? <laughs> I lost it. Over here. Yeah. I guess, ooh, which way? Where are you leaning? I guess that's fine, isn't it? We'll just put it in like that. There you go. Lovely. And then you have this do something like that and it will queue up on its own section of track. I'm going to say that's probably the best way to manage that. You know, we could change the other ones, but I do want to keep using that idea that I found out about. Now, are we going to have a supply tower? I think for now we are just like that. We're not actually using this just yet. What we can do now is give this express line a go. It's a, it's a biggie. There should be enough uh, maintenance buildings all the way up to knee shopping from there, though. There we go. There we go. That's where it's going. It's going to run through all of those. Unfortunately, it has to go through yarn shopping. Yarn shopping. Could have a bypass later on, if need be. It might just happen naturally as we expand the net network. And we're going to have it passenger and mail only. And we're going to put an express on, which would be the holder still. There is news of new DLC down under. Yeah, so we'll be heading to Australia and New Zealand. I don't know whether it's Australia and New Zealand. It just says down under. So that's something to look forward to. Gothenburg and Jan shopping. Jan shopping. Have we not got one direct? It does say express though. So I don't know. Probably not. So that's something on the horizon that I'm looking forward to. We don't have one. Or is it over here? It might be over here. Do we not have one? Seriously? My voice is getting higher, which suggests we don't. I just saw something grow down there. We do not, do we? We don't have a direct connection from Jan, Jan shopping to uh, Gothenburg. Well, should we sort that out, guys? Should we just have a passenger line go from there to there? Dear, oh dear. I never even noticed. Uh, passengers and mail only. There we go. And we'll have a we'll have a holder on there. Uh, with a stoker. Yeah, you get on there. Perfect. We don't have any spare engineers. Nope. It would say a star next to him if we have spares. Now, what grew? Something grew down here. There we go. Look how quickly they've grown, guys. This is absolutely marvellous news. Now, what else do you want to do? I mean, there are lots of options down here. We could have pig farm. We could have more crisp bread. 
I think that's probably a little overkill. We've got fish down here to hook up as well. Uh, steel, I don't want to take steel away from anything. I don't know really... I don't really know. I don't know really know. No, I don't. Um, Come on, pick something. We don't want to do the same as what they're doing. We do have grain here, I just noticed as well. Yeah, this is definitely looking like a secondary warehouse, which might deal with the grain. I forgot about this. We didn't even hook it up. This is one of the first things I said I was going to hook up. Should we do it? Because what we could do then, where's milk? Milk's up there, right? Yeah, which we can bring down here with a specialist line and only deal with milk. We could possibly take something back up to the warehouse here to spread out to these two, which, yes, would be a basic good. Maybe something like sausages. That's a plan. Okay, then. Right, we're doing it. We're going to... We're going to do, what do you want to do? Grain? We don't want to do grain anyway. We're not crisp bread. Ooh, these guys are going to be dealing with this. Their other clothes are down there, so that, seem, that actually seems a bit of a waste. So we do have sugar beet up there. We do have wood down here. Now, wood. Yeah, we got no one dealing with planks down here, do we? At all. So if how this warehouse could deal with that. Perfect, guys. Right, we've got a plan. And then that's that's planks down here, which is early on they need planks. I love it. Guys, a plan is coming together. Which means we're going to have to think about a warehouse somewhere at this region. Uh, we want the... We might as well just go straight up big. We can hook it straight into the apples. See, apples we can take direct, similar to what we're going to do with the milk up there. Uh, it's going to, let's let's uh, set it up, shall we? Let's not forget to put a, const a construct a, uh, a maintenance yard on there. We are going to deal with grain. This one is going to deal with grain. We're going to deal with logs. What else was it? We could take planks back and, and send them that way. I like that idea. Uh, what are the other end products down here? We've got that drink stuff, haven't we? Yeah, that we're not really dealing with. So we could technically send that up there as well oh they make it oh we didn't choose that you're both making it well that answers that that'd be pointless having it as that because they'll have direct connections there that could deal with that i mean we could have it auxiliary so planks only so far that's a bit rubbish isn't it i mean we already have potatoes why would we have potatoes going in there then that would make more sense to come into here, wouldn't it? Now that we're getting this new setup done. I mean, they could do with potatoes up there. But they could branch off from this warehouse and go somewhere into this mess of a junction. Or into there. Yeah, alright, we'll, we'll take potatoes from here instead. Which means we can think of a different one to have in the, uh, in here. Which might be to bring stuff from down here into there. So you've got potatoes in there. Let's max all those out. Anything else, Mr. T? Because <laughs> you, you're running out of ideas so far. It might be worth putting drinks in there. I mean, where are we going to send it to? It's going to go to the two drink peoples and two non-drink peoples. They're all connected to each other one way or another. That, again, seems excessive. We've already got fruit connected, but we don't have it in here, do we? No, we don't. Did we say we're going to take fruit across? I think we are, aren't we? Yeah, because we need to get some stuff up this way. I don't know whether they've got fruit. No, they've got fruit up there. They don't need it. So we can change that from potatoes and fruit and have this one as potatoes and fruit. Oh, these guys are going to need it. Yeah. Maybe we take all the fruit and potatoes into there and have a specialist train that carries both fruit and potatoes just direct into this warehouse. Then we could take... I've got an idea. Then we can take sausages back from there. Oh, now we don't have enough. <laughs> it's fine. Pick one. What do you want to do? Mm. I would say crisp bread. We can ship crisp bread across and then they could have a 
direct connection, actually. Yeah, so that's that would be pointless as well. Well, shucks. Now that I'm seeing that, I feel like lumber's good. Logs are good. Grain is good. Maybe well, fruit you're going to have to do because you're connected to it. I do want it to kind of be the lower end goods because that's what keeps them growing. Mm, yeah, I think we go with sausages because it's hard to get to from there. And then we'll ship, we'll ship sausages back to here from this warehouse. Yes, guys, because there's no pig farm down here at all. We've got it. We've got it. All right, stop messing about. Get all this connected up. Um, I've just realized we've got this station facing that way. So technically, we want a direct connection to come down here as well. There is so much to connect, isn't there, when you're just setting up in a new area? It's fine. I wonder if we'll get that bonus. It'll be interesting. I mean, I'll take 605,000. I mean, we've given it a go, right? Okay, so how do we connect all this up? We're definitely going to need some sort of maintenance yard, aren't we? I'm trying to picture this in my head. This one's going to be a connection down into here. So we need one that way. And one that way. I think that'll do us, right? I think that'll do quite nicely. This one then branches off around here. And can head either direction once it gets down to this point. And we can quad track that because we've got spare ones here. This is going to go direct. But I'd still like a maintenance station there. The reason being we, we can connect into that point too. And this one can bypass. I feel like we're going to end up with too many connections. It's fine. It's fine. We'll make it work. So that could be somewhere like there. Then we've got a branching point into this warehouse. There we go. And I think we can just do something like that. I want this to be kind of our connection up into this station. But we've, we've got one station. There should be two. But we might need to refinagle this a little bit. That's fine. This train's on the way back, so that doesn't matter. This one's on the way in, but unfortunately it has to be done. Because you're going to be entering a different station. Which means we might have messed up the line. We want this one to go in here, ideally. It works. Okay. I'm no longer upset with myself. It just doesn't look ideal. Now that can go in there. That one can go into that place. And there we go. We're going to have to switch our trains around a little bit. This is going to go into there. This about covers all of our bases, doesn't it now? Surely. Yeah, and then this one is heading up into here. There's our connection for that place. And what we're going to do, I guess, how do we get across, though? You haven't thought about that, have you? We need to get into, into there, which you can't do now. You'd have to come round to down. Ooh, that's awkward. It's fine. It's fine. I know, I know a way, I think, to figure it. There's the branch there. What we could do is have a turnaround here. It's a bit of a weird one, though, because we kind of want that direct, don't we? Yeah, you messed that up a little bit. Well, no. Do you know what? Saying that is have a little, a little curvy round here. So they go through two stations. I do like that. It's like I said, it's not perfect, but it, it, I think it will work, <laughs> he says. Then we can go into there. I know that's giving us two ways into the warehouse, but this one's more of a direct line straight into that station there. And then what? I mean, technically, you could have a line that goes across. I don't mind that at all. Where are you going? You go in there, right? Yes. Into here. Now, whether that one's ever used, I do not know. But it seems to work for me. And then this one's going to be connected into stations that don't exist down here yet. So should we put that on? This is a lot of fore planning going on right now. I just want everything to be able to go any way it likes. 
That's the plan. The question is, are we going to get all this set up in time? I do hope so. These we're all just going to send straight up like that. I don't see any reason to miss all of those maintenance stations. Although that junction looks probably excessive, it does allow our trains to not trip over each other at all, really. So I like it. There we go. Nice and neat. And then we want to be going that way and that way. That way and, and that way. There we go. That's beautiful. It's looking very busy. It's completely overkill, but I like it. I thought I'd go a bit uh, overboard this series. I've always been quite reserved. None of this ever happened. I'm just playing with ideas. Which is what the where half the fun comes in, right? How how much of a spider web can you make, and is it really that efficient? I'm gonna say it's probably very efficient when it comes to breakdowns. Whether it's efficient uh, for direct lines and stuff, possibly not. But breakdowns and random breakdowns happen a lot. Uh, there's not much you can do about random breakdowns other than research and get the best trains possible, and maybe put stokers and engineers on. If that happens, they're going to block the track anyway. But for things that we can deal with, such as scheduled maintenance and refilling, then this idea I like. It's kind of beautiful in a, in a very logistic kind of way. I do like it. Well, I mean, it's, it's happening, isn't it? Because look at the towns. They're growing straight off. Uh, yes, yes. Will that uh, make that auction cheaper? That'd be interesting. Right, what we can do is start upgrading. No, you don't want to upgrade them yet. What you want to do is actually get the milk there. We get to find out whether that's a thing, though, soon. Oh, yes, let's buy this cheaper one straight away. There we go, we're done. We've done all the current level research. What we've got to do now is head back that way, which means all of our points and auctions and anything we steal with spies should be in the in the back there okay wow they're they're growing already thank you thank you i'm not it's gonna be a while before i get that right isn't it it's fine okay now what do we want to, what's urgent this is really isn't it we need to get milk set up should we get this run going down here and what i'll get that sorted and make sure everything's on max we are going to head down it's a single warehouse can we take anything back with us possibly uh what would you need around here sausages it's it's all sausage fest up here isn't it don't, don't say that <laughs> well you know what i mean well it is isn't it uh october fest oh it's march anyway uh, we we do have sausages there, but that's a that's a bit a bit of a scarce sausage supply. We could have these making sausages. I'd like them to make parts of the furniture though. Uh, possibly the the tools would be a good one for them. Um, but uh, their third one could be sausages. Should we do it? Should we take sausages back into this one? Because I think we're gonna have a no. What are you doing? We want to go from there to there. Then we'll deal with what's what the consist is. Great only. You're going to take... Uh, no, you don't want any of that yet. You're on, Oh, look, it's already taken the bronest. Oh, that's what you're supposed to be taking down there. But just don't take it back. Right, let's sort your line out. Yes, we're going to need to do what the... Uh, oh, no. We're going to need to um, fix what's in that warehouse otherwise it won't come up as an option so we want to get sausages back up to here that's what i'm saying do we have sausages here though we do so that's probably i just bought that without even looking because i'm trying to think about what i want in this warehouse what i really want to bring back from up here fruit they don't care about milk we want to take down here along with bronest but not take back i mean the basic goods right yeah, do you know what? Crisp bread and sausages, and that's what we can bring back from that warehouse. Because we are feeding them from here, which will then encourage this uh, factory to kick into production. 
It would mean I would prefer to buy this. Because then we can upgrade it as the, the city grows. Plus we make money from it as well. Right, yes. So now we need to uh, figure out your line. Warehouse 6 is this one up here. So what you need to take from here is that and that and none of this. I don't want you taking any of that. It shouldn't anyway, but we might as well tidy it up, right? It's going to take that and that. And this one on the way back is going to take that only. I don't think you need to prioritize them, but we're going to do it like this. And then it's nice and neat. There we go. I mean, we could have brought apples back up. Where on earth are you getting salt from? I guess I planned on bringing that in from here. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad idea. I completely forgot about salt because it's a, uh, it's a basic requirement as well, isn't it? Well, we've got things underway now. We've finally got uh, fruit set up. Uh, which means we do want to do something similar to what we've got here. We're going to have to duplicate that train now. We've got it going. Right, it's done. So there, just in time as well, because it's going to drop off the Bronest for the first time. Uh, which will get that moving. Is that you? No, that's not you. Where are you? No, we've got plenty of time. He's all the way up there. That's his new route. So since he's all the way down here, we might as well duplicate him. There we go. He's taking milk. He's taking Bronest. I love it. I'm excited. <laughs> I, really, I genuinely am excited. You need a uh, maintenance building on you. You have one. Uh, does the new one down here? Yes, you do. I'm, I'm all sorts of uh, set up for that. You're growing. You've already started to grow. I love it. You should start getting your milk shortly because this guy is going to be delivering. Which train is that? Which, which train is that? We need to put this back on, don't we? That is not... Oh, yes, yes. This is kind of ideal, actually. Because uh, it highlights why <laughs> why it should not be doing that. It needs to go from the uh, new station, doesn't it? We change the stations over. What you need to do is be going there, please. There we go. Right, any other trains doing bizarre little runabouts around here? Probably. That one is now fixed. That one is not fixed you want to go into this station instead what are you doing that you have a very busy what was i doing there exactly shouldn't you just be going direct into here i don't know what all this is about what on earth is this train oh no i do you know guys i thought this was the line layout i'm like goodness me you're going everywhere no you're not are you you're just going to there there we go <laughs> Oh, that confused me. I thought I'd brought up the line manager. There we go. You shouldn't be on here. That's why it's confusing me. I fixed you. I fixed you. Right, anyway. We'll fix them anyway. Right, get rid of you. You're going to there now. We'll all be tidy. This is why I like to do them all in one shot, you see. And yeah, you've got a perfect connection just there. It doesn't really matter about this bit for now. It's, it's good to catch it early on, isn't it? So it's been caught and now we can fix it. So you want to go from there. That station is quite busy. Freight was correct. There we go. Guys, we're tidy. In fact, I'd like to upgrade that station because it's going to be ridiculously busy. There we go. We could upgrade them all, really. We can afford it, can't we? Right, let's check on staff. And we're going to buy everybody there. Mediator we do not care for. And there we go. Lovely. We've got a lot of no suitable freight up here. It's mainly up here. Ooh, connection bonus. Quick, 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 quick. Let's grab that. And we're just going to put a tiny station in here. And then we're going to delete it. We are going to need it shortly. But for now, all we can do is, is do our little cheeky thing. And, and just hook in here. There we go, 336k, and delete the lot. Beautiful, more money. Look at how much money we've got. What does that give us now? So we've got about, we could double our money. 
We could pay that off. That's an idea. Ooh, do you know, guys? We will tidy this up, all this no freight. But I think most of it is something that we're working towards up here. And that's going to be slow progre progress because Westeros, we left for a long time. But we are making these grow as, as it grows. The timing on that was absolutely perfect. Uh, they've just come out of winter, so they're not, they're not do, uh, degrading <laughs> or falling too much during the winter months, which makes me all sorts of happy. Uh, Vimmerby is growing quite fast which means we can start upgrading our steel production. We're going to have to keep kicking that up in order to make enough to start shipping direct to, uh, to Gothenburg up here. They're, they're on the decline. Uh, we could indeed increase that. That should help them a little bit as well. In fact, just put it to max. Why not? Which means, have we got enough running this now? Uh, not really. I think we've only got one train running this. So can we duplicate you? And I bet you fill up. Yeah, you do. And we just got a security guard as well. So, um, yeah. Do you want a security guard on there as well? Get on. Beautiful. We've got a lot of staff sitting around doing nothing, but I don't mind too much about that. Uh, we can sort that out once I'm happy with how things are going. Yeah, I don't know whether we'll get that bonus. It's a shame that they made uh, whiskey stuff. It's all right. Right, should we get to grain quickly hooked up into here? That would be a good start. Do we have, actually, do we have a train delivering into it? I wouldn't mind going into this bottom one, otherwise it's not going to be used the most, is it? You might be better off doing that, Mr. T. Like, we could have a, a, a mad, crazy junction come off down here. Yeah, I like that. That way we can run this all the way along. We don't have to finish it, but we can uh, run it to the point where we want our junction. Like that. And then we can run off into here, hopefully. I mean, we can do our little trick, can't we? To make that work exactly how we want it. Beautiful. Oh, it's done that again. I don't know what happens there. It's like it doesn't connect properly. Right, you click on it you are connected at that point but then you become disconnected i think at some point there we go in like that and then you in there maybe you have to click on that side again let's see no it just doesn't do it does it that's very bizarre that is very bizarre indeed i don't know what that is if we do it this way round, will that work perhaps it's the way round you do it there we go that'll do I don't care. As long as one way round works, I'm happy. Right, and then we can send our other train down this way. What do you reckon? Do we like that idea? Otherwise, we're just overburdening this station eventually. Uh, we'll expand that one, and we'll expand this one, because this is going to be a su super hub for us, isn't it, down here? I mean, they're all turning into big cities now. And we'll get this heading straight up to there. And then we've got to connect when we come back all of the uh, the resources into there. Uh, so there's a lot to choose from and get, uh, get our town growing. Definitely good timing on that. Do we have anybody else that we're interested in? Sure. If you don't make him unhappy, you're on. What about you? Let's load this train up. <laughs> Not conductors. Look at the little smiley faces. <laughs> there we go. We've got a conduct. We don't need a conductor on there, I should say. We'll end with uh, setting up this grain farm. And we're just, we're, we're going to stick with these. I do like them. I don't know whether they cost maintenance, because if they don't, then why wouldn't you set them up this way? And we'll run into the middle with this. Because I don't know which way we're going to be heading with this just yet. This will need a supply tower, obviously. Uh as we're not going to run any further, but it is a branch line. Or a spur, whichever you wish to call it. Get in there. Freight only. There we go, guys. We have... Yes, we have uh, grain underway. Should we buy that? Sure, let's do it. <laughs> we're not short on funds, are we? Who we got here? Um, get your message out of the way. An analyst. 
Yes, we do not need analysts just yet. We might do if we got to buy people out. He's non-stop. Come on. Just take him. We don't want uh, any any uh, security guards on this line, as it matters not. They, we wouldn't get any payment from it. These trains don't make us any money doing this leg, but they do eventually. There we go. Right. Yes, we got that going. We got that going. We're going to have to take sausages backwards and forwards eventually. We don't need to yet. Did I set this up? I did. Have you got... Where are you? <laughs> where are you? There you are. You're just passing through. Eventually, he's going to start delivering stuff, isn't he? Yeah, okay. So when we come back, what we got to connect into this warehouse? We've got the apple set. We've got that. We're going to connect the wood up. And the potatoes need to come across. Which should be an easy run for us. And then that's it. And we'll get this fish hooked up as well. As possible. Well, these guys are grown, which is lovely. Are you coping here? You should be because you've only got uh, you've only got one one place connected to you. We've got grain up here we could deliver direct to well I mean they are already, aren't they? Vimabi is stalled. That's okay. We're we're kind of slowly getting up to speed. Slowly but surely, though. Uh Yan Shopping's on the rise, that is beautiful. Gothenburg stalled currently, but that's not too disastrous because we can't do anything with it just yet because we don't have the tools or the uh what have we got here saboteur we do not care yeah we don't have the tools and we don't have the steel so we can't make that that's okay i think are you heading south as well i think you are right oh how many people are heading through there but well, we're going to sort that out as well don't let me forget <laughs> Dear, oh dear, these are the right mess. Uh, we should put a maintenance building before we go, though. I'll save it, and then we'll jump on board one of our trains. All right, guys, that has been it for today's episode. I'm, I'm, I'm saying it. We've got a lot done. It might, We may need to plug everything together yet, or most things, but all the, all the parts are in place, aren't they? Uh, as soon as we hook up those uh, key factories... Or facilities that we've got in the middle hovering around doing nothing currently and we've got another warehouse as well that has sugar beet uh, which we could pass some more goods around to i think this area is going to start booming and that is good for our bank balance and game progression we're only in june 1862 so good times still plenty of time to get this up and running we are doing them simultaneously we will check on the tasks at the beginning of the next episode. I promise that. And we've got some trains to sort out up on the coast. On the west coast, was it? Yeah, it would be on the west coast. Because there's a bit of a weird diversion going on. It's alright, we can fix it. So, until then, take care.